In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the Live Paint Bucket and Selection tool. So in Illustrator, those tools are these two uh, right over here. So the Live Paint Bucket and the Selection, they work kind of hand in hand uh, together. So uh, to show you what this does, I'm just going to draw some lines to start off with. And this tool allows you to fill in any area. You just have to make sure that it's completely filled in. So I'll be able to fill in this area because I have surrounding lines around it. This one I can't because it's not quite uh, filled in. The lines don't intersect each other. So to use this tool, I can come in here and click, hold and drag to select all those lines and then jump into the live paint bucket tool. Uh, I'll choose a color and then just go ahead and flip it, uh, fill in that spot. So any of these other spots I can't do that. If I really wanted to fill in another spot, then I'd have to come in and draw in another line and then just select all four of those sides around there again uh, to try and fill that in. Otherwise it won't let me. And in this case, I've already done it once, so it's not going to let me do it again unless I do this merge selected. So I'll go up to um, my object, live paint, and merge, and I can go ahead and click on that. So the tool right next to it, uh, what I can do with that, I can come in here and take away bits and pieces that I don't want. So I um, told you that the best thing to do is just kind of to uh, go past the shapes. So in here I'm going to grab these pieces, select them, and just press delete if I want to trim those. Um, maybe I don't want this line anymore. Select it and delete it. So it's a nice tool that aids your... Um, aids your live trace or live paint tool to manipulate and create the shapes that you want to create in Illustrator.